She's never bust a nuts and blames men for it. You know, she blames men. Like I said in my previous video, I do find it strange how some women could stack up a decently high enough body count. For some women in that stack, they've hardly ever, ever climaxed. And as a man, it's weird because it's like, why would you even go through so much effort just for nothing? Just for nothing. Now, one could understand if you're a woman that, you know, yes! like that's easy for you. You know, pretty much every man you've been with, you probably, you yes! know, whatever if you're such a lucky woman but for most women that's not the case so on one hand i do understand when some women do come across a man that you know is doing her properly how some of these women can obviously get lost and hooked to these men because they've never had it before for some women most men have probably been like very quick or just very below standard type loving or extreme extreme levels because he's probably watched too much corn Either way, a lot of men should understand, a lot of modern women are angry because they're not getting done properly. Yeah, society, the patriarchy, this and that, ah, oh, whatever, whatever. But if a lot of them are honest, they're just not getting done properly. Bitch, you think it's small. And what on earth is going on with Kyrie Irving? Like, I have no idea. I don't understand it. Like, you know, I'm, you know, I'm dumb. Fine, I'm dumb. I don't understand it. Feel free to explain it in the comment section or if you're a content creator, make more videos because I have no idea what's going on. He's a basketball player. He linked something and I don't even know. Explain it to me like I'm dumb because I don't even know what he did wrong. I'm still trying to figure it out. But yeah, enough waffling, enough waffling. City boys! Let's begin. Have you ever had an orgasm? No, no, I haven't. I've tried. I've like, you know, been with partners. Yeah. But uh, it's just never really been pleasure yeah. pleasure them but not me pleasure them but not me interesting interesting so now if i'm correct she said she's never ever had one damn with or without men because some women obviously you know a lot of women say you know by themselves help me help me they can do magic all day long they can make their box sing <laughs> but with a partner, it's more like a drowned out whimper. Pleasure them, but not me. Me crying because I can't ever finish with a man. Oh my God. Oh, sad. Oh my God. How sad. However, however, by myself, obviously by herself, she's cranking herself off. Well, obviously to high standards. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Come on. Come on. This is a serious topic. It's very serious. A lot of women aren't busting nuts. This is very serious. Come on. So obviously, even as a woman, to be able to garner the attention from men, many, many men, it still comes to a point where they still have to end up pleasuring themselves. Wow. Ah. Oh my God. You can understand why so many women are pissed. You can understand why, to a degree, they hate men. They dislike men so much. To a degree. Now, I've said this before, but, you know, women say it themselves. This is why a lot of them end up dating women. Because men, you know, yeah, some women aren't even getting done properly. And she's just lit. She's lit tearing herself up, isn't she? Well, I mean, she has to, I mean. And talking of women who date women, I mean. I mean, it should be all perfect, shouldn't it? I mean, you know, come on. High levels of emotional intelligence, yeah? Nope. Of course. For the straight girls that say they wish they liked women. Mmm, tasty. This is me before going to her house to give her her stuff back. This is me. <laughs> yeah, you're a man now, woman. You're a man. Yeah? It's a pain. You loved a woman. Now you're in pain. Yeah, be a man. Pick up your balls and go home. She's probably going to have to hit the gym, you know, focus on herself, bang some weights. Come on, woman, get your money up. Don't cry. Get your money up. Men can't afford to cry. You just got to keep going like a man. <laughs> yes, come on, woman. Man up. Man up. That's what it's like dating women. They make you tough for no reason. I will die on this square that a lot of women nowadays are angry because they're not getting done properly. Yes, I get it. It's too much. Is it too much though? Is it? Is it? You know, from I started making content, something I've always stood on is the fact of women's sexual nature is a powerful thing. It's, it's monstrously powerful. Now, some men understand it and, you know, obviously they'll manipulate women, you know, by, you know, using their own sexual wants and desires against them. Outstanding. And some could say it's evil. Yeah, I'm like, well, it's like, you know, she's having fun. How evil is it? Yeah, I'm just saying. But the point is, there are a lot of women out here who have never, ever had like a proper, proper experience with a man to the point where a lot of women have no idea it exists therefore they think it doesn't exist. So when some women hear other women talking about how amazing sex is, they may think it's a lie. It's a lie to them. 
because no man has ever touched her in that way. How do you feel about um, most women chasing like the top percentage of men? I think most women don't chase men. I think most women are just trying to live their life, and if you think that they are trying to chase men, then you are a little narcissistic. No, I mean like 80% of women are chasing like the top 10% of men. I don't know. I think people just live their lives, and I think if you think about people in percentages and numbers, it can get messy, and I just don't think it's worth it. I know why you're struggling to finish with the partner. I don't know why I'm singing it, but it's time for Just the Tips. Just the Tips. Just the... <laughs> I really... <laughs> just the... Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Just the Tips. Yeah, sure. For Just the Tips. It makes sense. I mean, it's very clever. Just the Tips. Yeah. The best sex tips in town. It's time for Just the Tips. Okay, she's still singing. Okay, so let's just... Uh, I think it will be over soon. The best sex tips in town. Anyway, you need to loosen up your grip. What? You have been training and training and training for years. Okay, before she continues, no, you don't tell modern women to loosen up their grip. Never. That's not what men want to hear. You know, I don't want... <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm being stupid. I'm being stupid. But look, come on, seriously, seriously, come on. You don't, you don't want to tell a woman to loosen up her grip. She needs to, you know, have more of a firm grip, especially women stacking up bodies. Come on. Using your hands, but your body is too used to the tightness that you're providing. So you need to loosen up your grip and retrain your body into the sensations that your partner is going to provide. And my mouth is so dry. I'm so sorry if that was annoying to you. That was the most sexual thing she said in the video. I thought I was going to get advice and got dry lips. But I think that's what a lot of women are suffering with. <laughs> and my mouth is so dry. I'm so sorry if that was annoying to you. Do not come. Okay. When you've never had a man last over one minute. Okay. Okay. So now we've ventured into one minute man territory. Yeah. Men, comment below what you think of to make yourself last longer. Pussy, pussy. I've actually thought about video editing. Seriously, I've edited entire videos in my head. Yeah, she had fun. And I made a sick video in my head. I made some sick videos in my head. Do not come. They'll never be seen, but oh my God, wow. Imagination is beautiful, but yeah. Do not come. Interesting. All right, what's your biggest ick? Okay, so might be a bit rogue, but when a boy gets hit by like a slow moving car, a slow moving car, so he's not injured, he's not injured, not hurt, he's, not, he's hurt. not hurt, but he just walks, he just, he's like hit a little bit and he's like, oh shit, and he just keeps moving. That's good. Big ick. Big ick. 21, can you do something for me? Can you talk to the ops next for me? talked about this on my channel before a little bit but i wanted to cover it because it is a common issue why is it that sometimes when my boyfriend and i are having fun things end early because he's deflated without finishing okay interesting is that even normal okay 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 so this is a sort of reverse thing of men not finishing because you know the benefit we have as men is that you know for the most part we're going to finish damn near every single time but for those times we don't finish why? Because it was crap and I faked it. I don't know if women actually think or even believe or even know that men fake it. Yeah, you can fake it as a man. Obviously, you can't fake ending on her face or something because... <laughs> really, come on. But yes, as a man, you can, you can fake it because it's just probably crap. The advice that I'm going to give you applies to any gender, by the way. First and foremost, I should tell you that the only way to overcome this is going to be to talk to your partner about it. I know people can be closed off to this kind of discussion. Just to reassure them that you love them, nothing has changed in your relationship, and that you want them to have a good time because it's integral to you having a good time. There could be a number of reasons that this is happening. First and foremost, and probably the most likely, is that they're too in their head in the moment. They could be thinking about whether you're having a good time or not. They could yeah, a lot of men suffer from sexual anxiety. He could be overthinking it. Or he could just be tired as a man. He could probably just be tired. I'm tired of smashing the same woman every night. Disgusting. Could be wondering what you guys are going to do afterward. It could be as simple as that. It could also be that they're used to a different sensation when they have alone time. They could also be having too much alone time. Talk to your partner and remember to be understanding and non-judgmental. Understanding, eh? understanding. I believe you should make your woman orgasm, but only if she deserves it. 
Yeah, but only if she deserves it. Have a nice day. <laughs> <laughs>